Oh, just look at this. <laughs> it is Sunday at about uh, 1220, the seventh day of July. And just a couple minutes ago, the sky just opened up completely. And I mean, it's pouring out. <laughs> and you know what that means for me. That is absolutely good news. Wow. And as you can see by all the water running down here, I'm uh, standing under the front porch, so I'm not getting wet. But, uh, yeah. Wasn't calling for rain again today, but that's nothing unusual about that. But, uh, like I said, it's, uh, I got to look at my watch once here. It's now 12.30 in the afternoon. And like I said, so this has been going on for about seven, eight minutes. And uh, a good rain, like I'd call it, oh, probably about a seven to eight. Eight to nine. <laughs> excellent. Absolutely excellent. Again, this is pretty well what we've been needing here. And it's been raining a little bit the 4th, a little bit the 5th and the 6th of July for a couple minutes here and there. Uh, enough to maybe get the ground wet, that's about it. But uh, this is definitely a whole lot more than that. So, and one of our little puppies, Midnight, come on! Come on! Oh, boy! Just absolutely soaked here. Yeah, yeah. I got to get a towel here. But come here, Midnight. I'm going to try to just kind of set the camera down here. Oh, boy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Try to get them dry here. Oh boy, out in the rain. Yeah, not good. You get hypothermia here so easy. The hot sun uh, just basically uh, dries you off so fast. So we'll get them dry here. Oh boy, and of course he's absolutely full of dirt and mud. <laughs> oh. Okay. So I'm uh, I'm full of mud. <laughs> As you can kind of see here, hopefully we'll get a good shot. There he is. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All black. Oh boy. It's uh, one of them that we decided to keep. So good. Yeah, you can't let these guys get wet. Like I said, that sun pops out. It draws the heat out of the body so fast. There, how's that? Much better, much better. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna, wow, it's uh, definitely an eight to nine now. I've got him uh, kind of covered up there. He's gonna start shivering here pretty quick. As you can see, all the dogs uh, come up on the porch here because uh, it's dry here. Wow. So nice. And I'm trying to cover him up here a little bit more. There we go. There. 
there. Wow. Yeah, this is as hard as it gets. It reminds me of the rain we got about three weeks ago here. Uh, wow. <laughs> and you can probably hear it on the roof here. So, wow, yeah, good news. And if you can see through the trees there, <laughs> Beth is filling containers over there. Uh, of course, she's absolutely soaking wet. She can take that a lot more <laughs> than I can. And uh, so I'm going to kind of stay right here. <clears throat> wow. Absolutely incredible. As you can see, all the water running down off the roof here. A little guy right here. Yeah. He still kind of cold. Yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah, we, we keep an eye on these guys. And hopefully it'll be okay. He definitely got soaked. And, of course, there goes Beth running, I guess, down towards the pig pen to see if uh, any of the piglets are getting wet because that's the same way with them, too. Uh, so I'm going to kind of sit down with the black one here while it's still raining, but uh, wow. Yep, absolutely incredible. And like I said, this is a good 8 to 9, 9 to 10. This is as hard as it ever rains here. So, and it's been uh, a little over 10 minutes so far. Yeah, trying to get this little one dried a little bit more. Keep her covered up here. Yeah, there. So they don't get the chills here. Keep that body heat in. Yeah, it's hard to realize here that uh, even in a tropical climate you can get hypothermia. Uh, if you get wet, that sun pops out. It's so hot. It dries you so fast, removes the moisture, it sucks so much heat out of your body so fast. <clears throat> yep. Wow, oh, so good. So good. And Beth is picking up containers there, as you can see, to fill containers for water. Uh, we haven't been able to pick up water most of last week. We've been uh, getting it out of our pool and hand carrying it over there. Uh, Lando has been off most of the week because uh, his wife Joanne had a baby boy by uh, C-section here uh, a couple days ago and uh, so hopefully he'll be back next week. Uh, and of course we support the family and that uh, completely and at this time and uh, don't mind at all that he's taking off work and a matter of fact I'm going to still pay him for the full week as if he worked. Uh, every little bit will help him out here. <clears throat> so I think I'm going to let you go. Uh, it's continuing to pour. It's been uh, over 15 minutes here and uh, it doesn't seem to be letting up and uh, I'll kind of get back here with uh, Kind of what's happening is an afterthought once it stops here. I'd love to go down to the pond because I'm sure <laughs> it's uh, well beyond overflow at this particular point as, as you saw once before. So on the back of the camera, I'm going to say goodbye for now. Everybody have a good day and uh, God bless every single one of you.